Full Sail is always on the move, looking for great relationships with entities that are the entertainment and media industries. So the fit between ESPN and Full Sail is more about how they're using all of the technologies and the knowledge that exists in almost every vehicle out there. As an example, when we have Big and Rich here shooting college football game day or any of those other big productions, we have show production students who are help managing the elements. You have marketing students, whether they're from sports marketing or, or entertainment business, who are helping with the event organization and the event planning. You have film students who are filming it. You have uh, RA students who might be adding musical elements as they put the finishing touches on an edited project. Um, that's just the tip of the iceberg in terms of, uh, of what the possibilities are. The initial vision was to really use the students and work with the students to um, to get a good view of what's coming up in the future, to get them to help us with where television's going, where sports broadcasting is going. And, um, you know, the idea was they're here and they're, they're learning in the um, film and audio industry, and they're going to bring new um, technologies, the way that they're consuming video, the way that they're consuming content. And if we could learn from them and they can learn from us, we felt like it would be a great partnership. Having the Full Sail University Sports Lab powered by ESPN on this campus is an amazing opportunity in so many ways. It gives ESPN an actual facility, a world-class facility, right here in Orlando, Florida, in and around the students of Full Sail, the faculty of Full Sail, you know, it's more than it's more than a specific location. It's really a, a, a concept in which we can take the worldwide leader in sports and the worldwide leader in real world education and put those two elements together. And I think the more projects we do, more people in Bristol are hearing about the opportunities to work with Full Sail. So the projects just keep coming because the students have all been very professional, knowledgeable in their area. Uh, the facilities here are, are amazing, um, and it's just been a great experience on all of our projects. One of the biggest advantages I see to the new space that uh, Full Sail has put together with the studios is that it really mimics a lot of what our studios are like at our headquarters in Bristol, Connecticut. So um, that going back to the experience I think that the school wants to put forward, which is the real world experience. So they work alongside some of our um, people that work at ESPN who may come down here to use the facility, uh, or they, you know, they actually get to work within new technologies um, in the studio, such as virtual technology, since it's set up very similar to how we have it at the headquarters. Uh, this is a great relationship between ESPN and Full Sail. What do I hope to gain selfishly? I hope to gain some wonderful employees in the future. Kids come out of the school ready to be employed in the real world, and that's the kind of work we do. The main thing that I think it makes this relationship with ESPN and Full Sail uh, beneficial is that with the emerging technology that ESPN is pushing, it, it can inform new directions that Full Sail students can, can look towards uh, in the realms of broadcast television. Full Sail has become the right place just because of the attitude of the faculty and staff, um, their willingness to work with us and the attitude of the students. We're very excited, as I think Full Sail's excited, about what we've done, and I'm not even so sure we scratched the surface. We're now in a, in a uh, larger space, um, a really nice building on campus, and we really plan on expanding our footprint here at Full Sail.